Let's see. Okay, go ahead. All right. 120. 120. Okay. So it's better than last time. Mm -hmm. All right. That's a good thing. All right. Okay, we're going to go right to the table when you're ready. <laughs> Please, it's because she don't stop talking about you. I swear to God, I'm not even being dramatic. Wait, wait, hold on. I want, I want to see a sign too. Gotta got to love my doctors and my nurses. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, you didn't get a good oh. one? Oh, oh my gosh. Let me check out on Instagram. Yay. Okay, okay, here we go. One, two, three. Thank you. Thank of course, you. of course, Thank of course. Right, I'll be in shortly, okay? All right, I'm going to sit down. <laughs> <laughs> I'm showing off my watches. You know me. You know me. You know me. Too many. Too much diamond and gold. Yeah, I'm the patient here. There's no HIPAA violation, but everyone's trying to trap me. But they're not. They're not gonna do it. So I'm just trying to live, guys. Just let me live, okay? And take care of myself, please. If I want to document it, I can. Thank you. Guys, I go to the doctor all the time. I know what I'm doing. Please, please just leave me alone. I'm just trying to take care of myself. All right? Be healthy. Responsible adult, unlike a lot of people. Hey. Hello there. Looks like you're losing some weight there, man. I have lost a bit. I was just some stupid diet, and my kidney stones bother me, and all that crap. Oh, God. Um, I'm on Instagram Live, by the way. Who? Just Instagram Live. So, That's just funny. so you know, I just want them to know that I take care of myself. So, there there's go. been a lot of bullshit out there, as you know. So, uh, this is my doctor, everybody. <laughs> and, Hello there. Uh, How you doing? <laughs> <laughs> my stuff is cooking one, so I look official. He's seen me about, what, <laughs> five, six times in the last couple months? Something like that. So, um, yeah, uh, there's just been, uh, well, there's been a couple issues that I got, um, in my right foot, I keep getting this, um, I keep getting this, like, this stretch. I, I don't know if it's because of the arch of my foot or the way I stand, but it'll, it'll pull in these, in, in like, the tendons, like, in this area right here. It'll get a little tight? Yeah, it, it kind of feels like it gets tight. At night? Like, yeah. And you're, like, when you get in bed? Well, well if maybe sitting, sitting, especially like driving. And how often is it happening? Almost every day. Any cramping in the back of your legs? No. You know, I get toe cramps. I've had them for a while. And I don't know if it's a cramp. It feels like some sort of a pulled tendon or something. And you haven't pulled your tendon. They don't. They don't pull. Or like, well, it, that's what the feeling is. Uh, that's no, what I'm saying. I'm saying. Yeah, I'm it's saying. Like, yeah, it's it's like a, it's like a weird stretching. Yeah. Like so, something's wrong. Nothing, with nothing foot. major there. Nothing. It's just it's just getting older. Sensation. Dancing. I I, I was gonna say I get my toes will like curl up like that. It's crazy. Where does this come from? <laughs> it just happens out of the blue. And um, well, also, um, you know, I talked to you about, you know, when I was nineteen, I was diagnosed with a hiatal hernia. Now, the the cigarettes that I'm doing right now is like explosive. I am under a severe, severe amount of anxiety and stress over all of the stuff that I'm going through, and. It's it's literally just you know I'm I'm getting stalked now at my house. Mm. I have to leave people, um, and because I'm coming out about my brother being a rapist, I have all these fans. Who was a rapist? My brother, Nick. Okay. And and he, I guess he's just really mad, and he's got all these people targeting me, and I was ruining Who's my brother? business, Nick. Oh. So and 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 um. When did that come out? That happened since I saw you last. Hmm? That happened since I saw you last, because I don't remember that. Yeah, it's, it's happened in like the last couple of months, you okay. know? And and my stomach is really like, it's it's really like flared up. Like like my hiatal hernia is like in my chest now. Mm -hmm. It's like really bad. Like the um, omeprazole, and they, I mean, I take it. I take, the, I take you know, that. I take the propranolol, but that's that's it. I will not, I refuse to take Seroquel. I don't like it. My mom got, my mom literally was prescribed to like, you know, 200 milligrams of, of Seroquel and is, I put her, I put her in rehab, you know, remember after we had to talk with her, 
I put her in rehab su successfully for like 46 and days. And she goes back to her environment. Goes back two on days, that. and then on top of it, they prescribe her the medication. On top of drinking, she never took medication in her life. Mm. So now she doesn't even realize that her chances are now. Really, and I, so I tried to help them, and then my whole family is like after me trying to get me fifty one fifty because they think I'm mentally insane. Do you think that I'm mentally insane? Everybody is. <laughs> <laughs> no, do you think that I'm, I, I'm? I know you have some psychological issues that I haven't put a finger on what they are because I haven't gotten a report from a psychiatrist from you. I, I don't usually make the only diagnosis I can usually tell pretty much off the bat is whether you're bipolar. Or whether you're a little depressed. Think I'm bipolar? Schizophrenic is pretty obvious. Am I schizophrenic? But if you have my, no. Schizophrenic people can't talk to me. What do you we, mean? We can't carry on a conversation. They start, th their mind's going here and here. They can't carry okay. on a conversation. Okay. So okay. you're not that. Okay. Well, bipolar, what is that? I'm bipolar not... has a tendency people talk a lot, don't need much sleep, uh, get feel have periods of either paranoia, mm. or they're worried about everything around, or they'll have like del hallucinations or delusions of, of things so don't, don't you think or, so don't you think it's ironic that I come out with all this stuff and then all these fans are pushing me telling me I'm bipolar or schizophrenic well, they can't tell you that they don't like, know your symptoms well I'm not bipolar so well I don't know that I can't say that when we're there because I don't know about all your symptoms well I've, I was treated by dr. Sagan I told you with Lisa Benya they tried lithium them out on but, me but it, there's a spectrum it's like autism there's a spectrum for bipolar there's people fully frank manic and people with slight bipolar tendencies well, well I am. A, I will stand up for myself. I'm aggressive. Um, if yeah. if I'm backed into a corner, but I think You're that can be misconstrued. That's risky, huh? You ever do things that are never? Risky? Oh, they're probably not bipolar then. I okay. don't. I mean, so, a, a four wheeler ride. Yeah, no. I mean, um, bipolar people do really strange things. Um, you know, going online, yeah. maybe uh, trying to lure people in that yeah. will, are, are are hurt and help them. So you're going to show me something in your stomach? Yeah. Well, see. I, I always know that the hyoda hernia is like affected. And you can't see it from the outside at all. Hello. So it just it has symptoms on the inside. So you take an omnipresol only once a day? I take it as prescribed. Well, I mean, if you're really having a morning, bad time, like you can morning. take it morning and evening. Well, well, you only told me in the morning initially. I didn't give it to you, at least not the last time you were here. Um. The first time, we gave it to you in July, and then we didn't refill it again. Mm -hmm. So we had had you on uh, one every other day back then. Right, right. But you're having more problems now. Well, I mean, the problems are this fucking stress. This, well, you and now I gotta move. Take, I gotta take it more often than right now. Take what? That the, the meprazole. Oh, oh it really? Every day. Oh, really? Because of the all right. Well, so now I know we spoke about Chantex before. I mean. I would like to get on You're it. Ready to I'm ready to do it. Okay. Yeah, I, I got to get off the cigarettes. It's, I got my voice. We can send that in. Uh, so I definitely, definitely need a Chantix. And which pharmacy? Uh, well, the, the, probably the same one. I, I'm okay. signing off, guys. Love you guys. All is good. At least you can hear my doctor. He, in his opinion, he he does not declare me as bipolar. I don't think I'm bipolar. And he's certainly not crazy. Off the wall, maybe not crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. You're the man. Come on, you got to put some weight on too, man. No, you're no, looking skinny. All right, love you guys. Um, anyway, um, also, another thing I wanted to talk to you about too was is that, you know... You're off now? No, no, I'm going to stay on it just yeah, for a I second. Yeah, I'm going to stay off because I haven't talked about some things. Okay, okay. Bye.